33 of the Omer, we call this day Lagba Omer, and this is Hod of Hod. It is a double portion of appreciation and splendor. And I want to start off by asking you a question. Have you ever had somebody you were close to who passed away? Somebody you were critical of during their lives, but you had that feeling, wow, if I could just spend more time with them, if I had an opportunity to see them again, I would so love to see them exactly as they were, with no changes whatsoever. Because the truth is that sometimes we're so incredibly preoccupied with changing people, with criticizing situations, with working to make improvements, that we fail to see the incredible beauty that exists exactly as it is. And I had a powerful moment of that recently when my son was in the hospital. You know, as a father, I'm constantly thinking about how do I educate my son? How do I mold my son? How do I help him become a greater human being? How do I help him see the greatness in himself? How do I help him achieve more, to be more? And yet, when he's in the hospital and he had something that was potentially life-threatening, thank God he, he got better and he came home. But in that circumstance, it was just a moment to look and say, wow, right now, I don't want to try to mold him at all. I don't want to try to change him at all. I just want to... Feel, I just feel so blessed to have him in my life exactly as he is. Now, of course, he came home from the hospital, and again, I tried molding him, and again, I tried instructing him, again, I tried helping him become, become more and, and use more of his unbelievable potential. But in that moment, when I was able to, to grasp the fact that, you know, we're all mortal, and we're all going to pass on at some point, all these relationships I have in my life are going to stop at a certain point. It's like, Wow. For that moment, I was just able to look at it and say how blessed I am to have that exactly as it is, and that there are no changes right now that need to be done at all. And throughout our lives, we tend to get into that. We tend to look at, wow, I have too much of this and too little of that, and I need to work on this thing, and I need to improve that. Today's not a day about that. Today's the day to say, you know what? All of this is part of a huge whole that is perfect exactly as it is. Today is a day for just appreciating everything and saying that all of these little troubles we have, you know what? They're here for a reason. They're here to help us grow. But they're part of a giant perfection that is so much greater than any of us. And we are so blessed to play a role in that and to see that this is all one, all perfect, doesn't need to change at all. Today is not about a day about changing whatsoever. Today is the day about fully appreciating all the incredible blessings in this 100% perfect world that we get to exist in.